Our unit's role in the exercise is to literally portray the bad guy and try to attack an aircraft. Some may think this is a bazooka, but you would be wrong. The 266 Range Squadron uses its manned portable aircraft survivability trainer, Fire. or MAST, and a sequence of triggers to provide live training missiles for pilots in the sky. And then the air crew uh, or aircraft itself can, uh, can practice evading. Whether or not it's a uh, reactive thing such as maneuvers or a passive thing such as jamming from the aircraft. Our threat operators are trained annually to provide that sort of uh, information and feedback so that the air crew knows whether or not they would have been successful in evading those kinds of threats. These gunfighters are a special breed. They are not only Air National Guard, but also experts with their equipment. This is designed for use by the Army. They can do all sorts of things in their field. What we use them for is just to talk to our remote launchers to fire SAMs from a distance. Other than using these, we're hardwired to the launchers, uh, usually about 100 feet out, 150 feet. Let's get back to the cool stuff and launch some smoky guns. So smoky guns simulate AAA. The only part of the AAA that it's simulating is the muzzle flash. From the, uh, from the gun. They go up about 500 feet in the air and you get uh, four bursts. From down here, it doesn't look like much, but front to, to a pilot that's flying around, uh, it looks like uh, AAA fire from the ground. So uh, as soon as these things time in. Reporting from Mountain Home Air Force Base, I'm Airman First Class, Devin Notstein.